Prince Bola Abdujabar, born on the 22nd of March 1934. The 89-year-old former judge of the International Court of Justice has made enduring and monumental legacies in his pursuits and accomplishments in humanitarian services. The 17th Founders' Day celebrations of Crescent University at Beokuta comprises a public lecture, investiture of awards, and foundation laying of Bola Jibola Gallery in honor of the man described as an exemplar of service to humanity at his 89th birthday. In the mind-blowing moment to celebrate the enviable attributes and contributions of Prince Bola Ajibola, royal fathers, academic and non-academic staff of the university, students and invited dignitaries eulogized the birthday boy, delivering a lecture with the theme, The Role of Universities in Human Rights and Elections. Professor Charles Adekoya advocates the need for the nation's ivory tower to promote a value-driven education system. In a situation whereby politicians have value, they will not sponsor violence before, during and after election. But we follow the due process by using the instrumentality of law to redress any grievance. It follows that if education in university is value-driven, they will produce graduates who will process the required skills, who are ethical and are able to resolve most dilemmas that may confront them in later life ethically. But what is important is that those state governments find us worthy and most parents want their children to be here because of our academic and moral excellence. Three distinguished Nigerians, including one of the Oloris of Oluwu of Owo Kingdom, Olori Adijat Bamidele Matemilola, were honored with Bola Ajibola Community Service Awards for recognition of their contributions to the society. You know, the foundation was launched just October, late October last year during the coronation ceremony, and the sky is still the limit. And by the lecture delivered today, by the guest lecturer, there are some other things that we still need to add to touch the lives of the people. Beyond that, it is also like an encouragement and a flip to the effort. It is a call to service, uh, basically stating that uh, what's been achieved is been recognized. Oluwu of Owu Kingdom, Obasaka Matemlola, unveiled the prototype of the proposed Bola Ajibola Gallery, as well as performed the foundation laying. In Abeokuta, Lekon Agmode, NTN News.